Cable instinct is something you have to develop. And here's how it works. We're going deep, 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 deep into the brake pedal. We're taking turn, uh, blah, blah, blah. Let's pretend turn one is real sharp, okay? Going deep, 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 and the tires are starting to make a little bit of noise. That's cool. And if you take a cable, don't do this. This is just a, a model. Okay, if you take a cable and attach it to the bottom of the steering wheel, run it up through the bottom of the steering column, and attach it to your toe when it's at its deepest part into the brake pedal, and you keep that cable tight, in order for you to turn the wheel, what's it going to do to your feet? It's going to lift. Right, right. It's going to lift your foot. Think about it. If you've got brake, 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 and then let's say we're using all our tires capability for braking. So guess what? If I try to get the fuzzy dice to swing to the outside, there's, there's no tire available for cornering. So you have to come back down in order to mosey on around the outside edges of the friction circle. So the, what happens is by using what, what I call cable instinct, when you turn the wheel, it lifts your foot off the brake pedal. Now you hit your apex and it's uh, time to exit. Trump on the gas? No, because here's what's happened. You've got, you're, now you're here. Maximum cornering capability. You're on the outside edges of the friction circle in cornering mode. You're pulling maximum Gs that the tires collectively can give you. In order for you to accelerate, swing the fuzzy dice out this way, you'd, if you did it with full cornering Gs, none would be available, no traction would be available for acceleration. So what do you do? Think about the cable. Now your foot's off the brake, you want to go over to the gas. In order to push it down, it's going to straighten the steering wheel. And that's bringing you down the outside edges of the friction circle.